How effective is the combination of your main product and ancillary text? This is the poster which I created for our film trailer of Obsession. The image shows a female character being strangled. Her facial expression looks fearful and vulnerable, which is something which we saw in many of the film posters which we had researched throughout our planning. Our film poster was designed to mimic and reflect certain parts of our trailer, such as the strobe light scene, where the male figure appears from behind her. I found this. This was shown in our poster as the background was burned out from Photoshop. However, the hands of the male antagonists are still highly visible. I found the film poster complemented the film trailer as it was easier for the audience to interpret the genre of the film through the poster as it was dark and suspenseful like many other th thriller and uh, film posters which we had researched. The hands of the male antagonist show our film trailer has a theme of addressing the issue of domestic violence within society. The l um, the lighting within our film poster was dark as we placed a single softbox light from far away from the centre of the face to highlight the centre um, of the face of the female protagonist and the hands of the antagonist. This matches our film trailer as it's effective as the scenes throughout our film trailer are dark and gloomy. Um, our tagline was, she finds faith but he finds her. This reflects scenes such as the car scene where the antagonist shouts at the protagonist throughout, uh, through the window of the car and also running away scene. The font, um, the font was used both on our text um, on the poster and also was written out on um, Final Cut Pro on our film trailer. This was blurred out. Um, as we saw this from an idea on one of the ones, one of the posts, the, the film magazine cover which we used, it was Studio Magazine, which was effective because it was Britain's first uh, all women's film magazine, which draws in to the female audience which we targeted towards, as it, as we thought our film was addressing domestic violence in a dramatic and suspenseful manner that it would attract a lot of women. Our full magazine cover was inspired by this cover as studio magazine also because um, of its simplicity of the photograph. I made the female character have multiple bruises and bloodshot eyes on Photoshop. This mimics the scenes where you can see the female character within the film trailer, within the bruises, where she looks distressed and upset. Our film magazine cover has multiple colours used in the background in light, uh, which is contrasting the upset, bruised and battered female character. And the magazine cover had words such as exclusive interview with the character and also had based on true events written on it. We thought this coincides with the film trailer where there is well this is also illustrated and it would draw in a more wide audience. In conclusion, this illustrates how effective our combination of main product and ancillary text have been successful.